Hello everyone, welcome back to all computer classes. This is part 2 of chapter 12 and uh, we are studying about PowerPoint. So today's topic is inserting images and that is from file, from clip art and from internet, right? And the second topic is changing background color of a slide, right? So let's get started. Before learning how to insert images in PowerPoint, let's know about the file formats that are supported by MS PowerPoint, right? File fa file formats means the kind of file that can be inserted, right? So the most common file formats supported by Microsoft PowerPoints are GIF, that is, that is Graphics Interchange Format, JPEG or JPG, Joint Photographic Experts Group, then PNG, Portable Network Graphics, and BMP, that is Bitmap Image File. Right. So these are the kind of files that can be imported in a PowerPoint. First way of inserting images from file. File means the image is already saved in your computer. Means the picture is offline on your system. So for that, I have this option within my slide insert image. Right. So if you choose this title and content slide, this option comes by default. Right. So you will click here insert and so I have this folder with me flowers so I'll insert the first one click here select the picture and click insert now the image has come on my screen it's looking really very beautiful so you can increase the size of the image now the second way of inserting the images go in the insert tab and here pictures now I will insert another image and click on insert so another image is there on my screen now you can adjust the image so the first topic was inserting images from file right now the next is inserting from clip art so clip art is the collection of photographs that comes with a microsoft powerpoint now the first way to insert from the slide itself let's search for home so so it has these images so I'll click and I can insert now let's search for flower so I'll click and I'll get this picture right so I can decrease the size also again now let's search for science and click on go so these are the images of science right so this is how you can search from the clip part now the third method is inserting from internet from internet means I need to open the web browser so I'll go to the Google right so this is my web browser I'll search for national national flag of India click go in the images and so we have got many images now let me right click on the image and click on the copy image now copied you have copied the image come back to the slide right click and paste it so this is how we can insert the file from the internet for that i need to go to the web browser right so let me search for garden so garden image so this is very beautiful right click copy go back to the slide right click and paste so this is the garden image i have got i hope students you have learned how to insert images from file that is already saved in the computer from the clip part which comes with the powerpoint and from the internet right so you need to search the images in the internet copy and paste here so these are the three methods of inserting images the second topic was changing background color of a slide right so this is my slide whose background i want to change so for changing the background color of a slide i need to go in the design tab right here in the design tab i have got this background styles in the background styles i have got this format background so in the format background i will get this option so here the white color is chosen let me choose the green color and click apply to all so if i click apply to all 
color will be applied on all these slides if i change the color let me choose this color so apply to all so this is how i can change the background color even i can use the gradient right so for here i have preset colors so these preset color can be inserted so for example i choose this and click close so the color will be applied to only one slide if i'll click on apply all then it will be, will be applied on all the slides so i need to go in the design tab then in the background group i have this background styles so these are these are the basic uh, styles which are available and from here i can format the background the way i want right so the color which i want for more width i can increase the width or decrease the width right direction so direction is horizontal for now if i want to change the direction i can from linear to rectangular so the color is in the form of rectangle path and shade from the title right these are the various options so one for, for from the solid fills second from the gradient and then a picture or texture fills so some pictures and texture fills are available here right for example i want to give background of this let me put some other color light so this texture is available here and i'll click apply to all so it will be applied to all right so this is how i can change the background style now let's go again and click on the format background so first was solid fill gradient fill picture text and pattern pattern fill so some patterns are also available here apply so this pattern is applied to this pattern is applied to all now let me show you the in the background this beautiful patterns of very very thin green line is appearing right so this is how we can change the background styles so students i hope you have learnt about inserting images and changing the background color see you in the next video till then take care and goodbye